In Plain Sight by Richard Jackson and Jerry Pinkney. Sophie lives with Mama and Daddy and Grandpa, who lives by the window. He can see Sophie come and go, call and wave goodbye, hello, as he looks out. And after school each day, Sophie looks in. Here I am, Grandpa, she says. How was the morning? Surprising, he says. I had me a paper clip, you know. Nice and shiny. Now it's vanished. Help me find it, will you? With your bright eyes. Where? says Sophie. That's just it, That's just it honey. You have to look. If you lean close, you might hear Sophie say, Oh, and eventually you might hear her say, There. Good, says Grandpa. Thanks, honey. Here I am, says Sophie on Tuesday. Ah, Sophie, he says, how was school? Good, it was blue day. Well, I can see that. And how about you, Grandpa? How was, mm, regretful? Oh, yes, I had me a rubber band, stretchy bowing now. Bowing. That band is gone. Help me find it. Here I am, Grandpa. And eventually, in plain sight, Here I am, Grandpa, says Sophie on Wednesday. Was today better? Not so much, Grandpa says. Had me a drinking straw, Bendy. Just right, you remember? Now it's skedaddled. I look, says Sophie. I wonder, and eventually, in plain sight, Good girl, Grandpa says. Thanks. On Thursday, Sophie says, here I am, Grandpa. Anything missing? Well, wouldn't you know Grandma's favorite painting brush from Watercolors Child? I'm missing that. Can you help me, lovely? I can try, says Sophie. And eventually, in plain sight, here I am, Grandpa. Friday at last. You bet, honey, he says, turning his smile to her. But wait! Just look. Oh, Grandpa, you silly. Keep the dollar, Sophie. Tomorrow, he says, you can buy yourself something with it. Here I am, Grandpa, Sophie says. Early today? No shopping. Well, best to save that dollar. I guess for college now. Let's see. Hand me, um, what? A lemon drop? Delicious to think of. But then, it just trotted off, unlicked. Don't tell me, Grandpa. And eventually, in plain sight, Good girl, says Grandpa. No, no, you have it. Sunday morning, as usual, at his door, Sophie starts to say, Grandpa, here I... But Mama hushes her, sleeping now. Which gives Sophie an idea. She whispers it to Mama. Daddy laughs when he hears. All right, he says, if you tipped her. Here Sophie at her very quietest, her tiptoeest, that curtain at Grandpa's window. Well, keep your eye on it, this curtain. And eventually, where is Sophie? Grandpa wakes. Oh, Yanza. Behind the curtain, a commotion, wiggling, jiggling, giggling. Sophie, Grandpa says, that you? Why, I'll be? Here I am, Sophie says. Like always. For Brian Flocka, Seeker Finder RJ. For my great granddaughter, Zion Mackenzie Noel, who helps me keep in touch with my inner child, JP. That's the end.